is Kasiga's Beatrice from Uganda, a farmer from the grassroots who fight for women's rights in farming. For us as SF Uganda, we are helping farmers see that they can come out with one voice to look for the market as, a, as in their groups, if they want the market. And we are training them about the agroecology, climate change, food sovereignty, so that we can help our Ugandans see that they can go back to their mother's seed. We are here to fight for our farmers. Mostly me, I'm fighting for the women in the grassroots, in Mobende. Because all of the women cannot fight for themselves, they need a voice. They, know, they need to train them to see that they can fight for themselves. Most of we women, we are the people who work hard in the garden, but we are harvesting little. Because mostly, let me say, domestic violence. After digging and you harvest, the man can come and take all the money you have saved from your produce. And you remain with nothing, you remain with no food, you remain with uh, no money. And so you start looking for food to feed the family. And another one, it, has ab it is about the land. If someone lost his husband, you don't have the right to remain on the land to look after your children. So for us, as in Uganda, we are fighting for those women who cannot fight for themselves. We are training them how they can get together in their groups and fight for their rights. As Ravaya Campesina, we want to thank Ravaya Campesina because it has helped the country organizations to come out. Hmm? They are sensitizing us, they are helping us to take us to the workshops, train us, and when we go back, how we can train other women to fight for their rights. Let me tell you, as women, we have to come out, see that the government can make a favorable policy for us, like our seeds. For us, every season you have to buy seeds, but our grandmother's seeds, you continue keeping your seeds, keeping them very well, looking after them. So we want to go back and tell the woman to start selecting their own seeds. Instead of planting the hybrids, one season you have, the next season you have to buy seeds. And the next season you have to do this. And to, to train them how to use agroecology. Because agroecology helps us to keep our life very well. Because if we use the surrounding things we have, let me say, for example, you have your cow at home, you can use the cow dung as manure. Hmm? And we have piripiri, let me say, we have piripiri, we have us uh, which you cook in the kitchen. If you mix it with the piripiri, you can get a herbicide so that you can spray your greens and what and what. Instead of using those chemical things to spray your greens so that we can help ourselves. We are here in Sri Lanka, we are here in the International Women's Meeting. So when we go back, we must see that we help other women to catch up. Hmm? And we task the government to help us. Because we are doing a great work, we women, we are the one we producing, we are the one working in the garden, we are the one cleaning the house. Hmm? Our men, if you go with your men to the garden, after the garden, the man will come and rest. You, you continue with the work up to the evening. And we are not paid. Hmm? And we have to train our girl child now, because for us, our years are going. We have to train our girl child to stand up. They can advocate themselves. They can be assertive to fight for their rights. In the future, we are thinking the women will be on a good level with the men. If they are competing with the job, it's okay. But for us in Uganda, the good thing, the women also can campaign, compete with the men in the same post. There is no problem. You can stand with a man. And in Uganda, you are saying all women and men are equal. They can do the same job. They can compete together. So we want the next years when to come, we want all the women to be empowered. See that they can do what they want.
because they are the one working, they are the one training, because a woman is the one to be pregnant, a woman is the one to produce. If you produce someone who can do something which is strong, the men are there to look after what is produced. Hmm? If the children is not good, you say this one is for a woman. If it is a better children, it is for a man. But we are together, we must fight together. I am calling all the men, you know, hold the word, to come and support women so that we can go together, to fight for our rights, fight for what we can do hmm? to get a better food, to get our organic food. Because organic food is good for our life, organic food is good for us, is good for our kids, so that we can go back and we get our grandfather's seeds, which can resist for pests and what and what. I'm calling even the government to make favorable policies for us. I am also asking that the, I want first sack Ravaya Campesina for organizing such a meetings for we women, youth and other people. Because now we are suggesting that they can train our youth especially the young ones, the younger women. Now they can grow up when they are strong so that they can debate for themselves, they can ask what they want, and the government can make the policies they want so that we can come all together and we can fight for our nation. <laughs>